Hey guys, welcome back to another Big Meat Sunday. Today we're gonna do a spaghetti squash recipe that's super easy, super fast, and uh, well, you, if you've been watching my channel for a little while now, you'll notice that little guy over there, today's his big day. He's going adios. Let's cook him. Okay, so we have our little squash here. He's crying, if you'll notice, because, well, he's going to the oven. So uh, let's get him cut up. First thing we want to do, whoa, is grab the biggest knife you got. The, currently, this is mine. Uh, and basically what we're going to do is split them down the middle. Um, sometimes it's tough, and it's, uh, you almost, feel like you're going to cut your thumb off. Let's try to avoid that. So basically I want it to where it will just sit on its own and then I'm just going to stand back and hopefully I'll hit the center of this guy. And uh, yeah, that looks pretty good. Ta-da. And now what we're going to do, we're just going to take and remove a lot of these seeds, take a spoon, it's just super easy, just like a pumpkin kind of thing. Just begin scraping and get all that uh, kind of sinewy stringy stuff scrape all that out right into the trash can and we'll do that with the uh, second one too okay we've just deseeded our uh, two halves and uh, taken all the strings and stuff out and just kind of washed them up a little bit what we're going to do now is uh, just hit them with a little bit of salt just a little bit on the inside on both halves And I'm going to get them into a baking dish. Face down. And we're going to take about a cup of water. And add that. Uh, have the oven running at 350 degrees. We're gonna pop this in there for about a half an hour. After half an hour, we're gonna flip this over, kick it up to 425 degrees, and let it go for five minutes. Okay, guys, so it's been probably 45 minutes or so, and uh, we're gonna get ready, pull these guys out. We're gonna throw uh, little pads here. Let's grab these dudes. Oh, they look great. They look perfect. Just a little bit of toasty on top. A little bit of steam. But you can tell, uh, you know, the way you can really tell these guys are finished is if they just seem very soft. Kinda, and they peel back like that really simply. Very easy to just manipulate, if you will. Uh, so yeah, these guys are good to go. So that's really all there is to it. Uh, it's super easy to cook. Just throw it in the oven. Let me taste this here. Mmm. Nutty. There's tons of flavor there. It's incredible. So, you know, there's really not a lot to cooking squash. Uh, you don't have to cut it up into little tiny pieces and throw it in a pot of water. That just boils all the nutrients away anyway. Uh, throwing it in the oven, it's basically steaming in its own juices. That's what you're looking for. So anyway, this is a great recipe. Hope you guys use it. Uh, there's a lot of different purposes for this uh, spaghetti squash. In fact, I'm gonna be doing a recipe right after this that incorporates this. So why don't you check that too. Anyway, thanks for sticking around. You know the drill. Hit the sub button down there. Thanks for sticking around. Take care of you guys.